developments with this night of protest breaking news downtown Dallas Young and Lamar is where Steve Pickett is Steve what's going on I need that Doug I need Doug I'm here Steve I'm here Steve go ahead what's going on down there Doug I'm trying to get out of the I'm trying to get out of the tear, tear gas this is killing us so we're going behind the line <coughs> I apologize, folks. Steve, Steve, go ahead and catch you your breath. With that tear gas. Catch your breath a second, Steve. So Steve Pickett downtown. He is near Young and Lamar. Woo. Tear gas has been deployed. So we're trying uh, a to lot. get around. Sorry about that, guys. All of a sudden, we got hit by tear gas. I can't breathe, sir. I cannot breathe. I'm live on TV. I cannot breathe. Woo! What they've done, guys, is they've created a perimeter. They're going to move people out of here. You can see uh, the alignment of police here. And I apologize, folks, because we got hit with that tear gas. But officers have now surrounded the whole area. So I apologize. Our, our video is not good right now. We've got mounted patrol. DFR is coming in as well. So, Doug, I apologize. It is for the most part fine there's no real trouble here where i'm at young and lamar but they have used that tear gas to try to disperse people and that includes members of the media such as me have already been threatened with arrest and as you can see with my eyes that's what happens when they disperse that tear gas i'm going to send it back to you if it changes here i'll let you know all right Steve Pickett, thank you very much. Steve is at Young and Lamar. And again, we've heard, uh, as I bring Andrea Lucia back into the conversation, we have heard over the loudspeakers from the police vehicles telling the crowd to disperse. It is time to go home, we have heard. Andrea, same message where you are? Yes. Yes, I actually walk back toward Young and Lamar. I am, a, I am a, sort of across from where Steve is. I'm just outside the perimeter. If you take a look down this street, you might be able to see all of the police cars that are here. There are uh, many lined up down this street. This is a perimeter that they are holding. Steve is on the other side, so he got that tear gas. I did not. Um, and police are trying to restore order. We have repeatedly heard them uh, trying to urge protesters to leave and to go home. Leave and go home. Doug. Andre Lucia, thank you very much. Uh, Chopper 11, let's take a quick peek again. We have been following a sizable crowd that broke away from the uh, big crowd that began this evening again around 6.30 on Lamar, south of downtown at Dallas Police Headquarters. And now it appears a lot of police have gotten together, but that crowd that we have been following is now dispersed. More to come. Our continuing coverage here on CBS 11 News at 10 o'clock.